sure about the colour yet, but I started out with a green because I wanted to use something that was um, not necessarily a colour that will be in the final print, but that you can build up so you can go from a very, very light green to quite a dark one. Yes. You're going to get the yellow and a, a yellow with green. Yeah. Can we get more of a lemony yellow than a cadmium? So more... Um, that side, that side, okay. that side of it. What I'm aiming to do today is to finish with a print that I can take away and just look at and then really sort of think about the colours I'll maybe work on it with watercolour or something and just see if you know see if I can um, be clear of the colour and then in a couple of weeks time I'll come back and then we'll you know start and do the prints. That's a double hit so I'll do a single hit. Okay. It really makes it sort of yeah. leave doesn't it? Yeah. It's a bit too strong isn't it? Something kind of like that. Okay. What do you think? Probably get three colours that are kind of slightly different hues do you know what I mean? So yeah. that I can kind of think about um, well, I'll, I'll mix something up and get as close as we can to see where it takes us, either towards here or towards yeah, there. Yeah. Um, it might be easier to start with so there, because then I can warm it up a little bit. Think, yeah. yeah. Um, What's that sort of blue, and we need to make it sort of reasonably pink. transparent, yeah. don't we? So, okay. Somewhere there, but I think it feels right in terms of composition. Yeah. 